My life different, my pipe different, my fight different, my time different, my mind different, my grind different. Welcome guys, welcome. It's your boy Crypto Magnet 777 coming to you guys with a quick video on some some unfortunate news in the world of cryptos. But before we get into that news, hit that like and subscribe button and join us on a journey to 10,000 subscribers. And again, guys, none of this is financial advice. My simple, my simple, humble opinion. Before we head to jump over to that Patreon, we have three tiers, five, 10, and 25. If you're new to crypto, join the community of the crypto investors where you get to have some one-on-one on which cryptos to jump in and which ones avoid. And so guys, jump on over. Today, 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 we have some unfortunate news. We have crypto exchange this is hacks. If you guys haven't seen the markets are down and everyone's wondering why is the market down why is the market down why 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 well one exchange hit unfortunately had a security breach we have over 200 million dollars worth of cryptos but also aka us dollar loss and um stolen so b bitmart ceo has confirmed that the company is calling a security breach unfortunate the latest centralized exchange hack may be among the most devastating to date as Bitmart has lost 196 million in, var in a various cryptocurrencies. A tweet from the security analyst, firm Peckshield, first called attention to the alleged hack Saturday night. One of Bitmart's addresses currently shows steady outflows of, an, of an entire token balances, some worth tens of millions of dollars to an address currently labeled by Etherscan as the Bitmark hacker. In a follow-up tweet, Shields estimated the loss to be 100 million in the various cryptocurrencies on the Ethereum blockchain and 96 million on the Binance Smart Chain. The hacker has been systematically using decentralized exchanges, DEX, uh, one inch to st swap the stolen assets to the cryptocurrency ether and using a secondary address to deposit the ether into a private mixer trade of cash thus making the hack funds harder to track guys this is uh this is these are some smart criminals out here and this is one of the very very scary things that's happened that has it is still um going to be happening unfortunately until our crypto world is you know i don't want to say this word but regulated and it's because we have, we're, we're going into to, to ne new technologies where it's 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 there's some vulnerabilities when those vulnerabilities are are breached millions and millions of dollars are, are stolen in the process if this was a bank and i had my money in the savings and you're telling me this somehow you guys' bank or hack it's it's kind of the same thing because that's a lot of money that, that goes into these exchanges millions and billions of dollars and eventually if it hasn't already trillions um as well so it's really unfortunate news and it's really uh, it's really has affected the charts as well if we go through again the news is really everywhere so if we go to the coin market cap if we go to coin market cap we check that out you'll see it's red everywhere unfortunately but some of the some cryptos out there are winning you know depending upon where you're really at but if you really look you know bitmark was one of those big time players they a lot of people use bitmar to um jump into the altcoin world and it really really is unfortunate but you guys look at this just move myself out the way this is crazy we can go down the board but it's nothing to fear we are diamond handers out here we are not paper handing these we are not selling these we will hold 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 because as we all know in cryptos just because it goes down does not mean you should frown. Crypto is a very volatile, volatile um, choice and decision to do in life. Uh, it's not. It's not for the. It's not for the weak. Uh, but it is something that is interesting. And again, none of this is financial advice. It's my simple uh, personal opinion. But it is something that is exciting and is something that is for the future. And with these tip, these new technologies come with these new risk. But as things and securities and technology advances, so does the security and software to help protect us. I'm bullish for cryptos. I still see the market is going to eventually be green in the ways that cryptos are meant to be. But hey, now that's just financial advice. I'm just a crypto lover. You know, it is what it is.
It is what it is, guys. But Bitmart was hacked. Two hundred million dollars was stolen. Um, really unfortunate. A lot of a lot of people have been speaking out on um, the security breach on helping out. I know that John Crony over at Safe Moon he also reached out and has been very vocal as Safe Moon was one of the many cryptocurrencies that were hacked in a part of that breach. Unfortunately, we go to Bitmart. They've been having a lot of announcements out on Twitter as well, which is. Good, because we don't want them to be quiet and it's something that's as severe, as severe as this. Uh, we haven't identified a large scale security breach and we are now conducting a th thorough security review and we'll subscribe to maintain transparency. All withdrawals are temporarily suspended until further notice. Hit Mark, I wish the best for you guys. I wish the best for anyone in the crypto space. This is definitely one of the unfortunate things that has happened in this space as we continue to advance produce get regulation i don't know i do know but hey this, that's for another day for another stuff for another conversation Ben martians thanks for all your support and patience withdrawals are temporarily suspended for investigation and safety pur um, for purposes some deposits and training um trades are affected check our official announcement so you guys gotta go to the bitmart dot you gotta go to the bitmart website to really stay up to date with this process again unfortunately and Shinibu was a part of this process too a lot of cryptocurrencies were affected because these are big exchanges to help many people get into the altcoin world it's unfortunate but i am still bullish for the world of crypto stay tuned guys again this is your boy crypto magnet i'll see you guys on the moon my life different my pipe different my fight different